Hey guys, Peace for here, and today I'd like to be showing you guys the second version of the multi keyboard mod. And first off, I'd like to wish you guys a Merry Christmas. Um, you can say this is my Christmas present to you guys. So, yeah, let me get into it. So, the first change is that we're using a new library, so that means you don't have to do the whole installation process of the interception library in my last video. All you need to do is just go to the web page, hit the download, and then run the EXE or Super Smash Flash. And you you can play it right there and then. So no long installation process. Just go to the download page and get it and you'll be fine. Um, the second update is that um, keyboards now save your controls like gamepads. If you ever used a gamepad in Super Smash Flash, um, you would know that if you plug in the same gamepad, it would save the key, the key binding. So now keywords do that. So that's another cool update that I added. Um, what else did I add? Um, disconnect. So if you unplug your keyboard now, um, it now registers in the game, so you so you don't have to reset um, Super Strange Flash. Um, it's kind of buggy, so I'm working on it, but yeah, it works for the most part. And the biggest update I think that most of you guys came here for is that now um, Super Smash Flash works, this mod works on Parsec, so we no longer have to use the splitter. Um, you can now just use this mod and you be able to you be able to play with your friends. But um, a fair warning, you still do need two keyboards to use this mod on Parstech. Because um, if I remember correctly, or this is how I think it works, is um, Parsec uses your default keyboard, and that would be used for the um, the person connecting, and then you have to use the other keyboard. So, just a fair warning: you still need two keyboards to um, to use this on Parsec. And yeah, that's the update. I hope you guys have a merry Christmas and a happy holidays. I'll see you guys around. Peace.